Hi everyone, Cynthia Luhu here, and I'd like to share with you some necklace sets that I made. I'm going to be wearing these at Cha. Um, I thought I had to, you know, at least do something a little dressy for Cha. Um, so anyway, I made them all with filigrees. And I have it on a lampshade. I think that that's a perfect way to, if you don't have a bust, to showcase. So I just used some filigrees and some rhinestone chain and some bling and this is a Rivoli crystal. This is some beautiful teeny tiny, sorry let me zoom in, teeny 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 tiny rhinestone chain that I got from um, Sherry Peters. She sent me a bunch of goodies and um, I don't know if she has a YouTube but she sent me some beautiful goodies and those we're on it. So there is the first one. I made five, one for each day. I actually made six, but I gave one to my daughter, Aubrey, because it was pink and it had butterflies, and she said that she loved it. So she she snagged that one. <laughs> okay, and then here is the next one. And this one has a uh, uh, druzy quartz, and then just some. Uh, bling and then I put a bunch of uh, crystal aurora borealis um, rhinestones and sapphire colored rhinestones all the way around and that's just uh, there's one two three four five filigrees and I thought that turned out really pretty and elegant and here is the next one I'm not going to do a tutorial on these, but I will be selling some on my website when I get back from Cha. So this one's a real pretty amethyst. Let me lift my light. The light's up. Maybe you can see it better. And there's three butterfly filigrees here. And most of these filigrees are from Butterbee Scraps. I got a big ol' order from her. And um, this rhinestone chain I got from Tammy, Tatsy 2. She sent me a bunch of miscellaneous goodies and that was in there. And I just cut it apart and used the rhinestones. And this is a um, Rivoli crystal. Okay. And the next one. Here's the next one. It's a deep rich emerald and I colored all of the rhinestones with alcohol ink and I don't remember the color but it's an emerald, a nice deep emerald. It turned out real beautiful. Um, and I used a flower filigree. This was from D and this filigree behind is from Saw and then these are all from Butterbee Scraps. And then the last one is a dangle butterfly. This one's quite a bit longer. I'm going to have to uh, shorten this chain. It's just much way too long. The chain's too long. So this one I made with all pewter. And I got all these filigrees from Butterbee Scraps. And then um, I did wire wrapping for all of these dangles. Added some Aurora Borealis rhinestone, some pretty beads and bead caps, and I've had these bead caps forever. And this butterfly is from Butterbee Scraps, and then I just took a filigree, one of these, and I just twisted the top to make it to a point, but be able to hold the jewel. So that is all five of my necklaces, and I will be taking some photos, so stay tuned for that, and I'm going to post them on my blog as well. So, so thank you so much for joining me, and um, we'll see you soon. Bye.